In this video, we're going to show you how to remove the front door wing mirror from a Leon Mark III. Tools you'll need for the job, an 8mm and 13mm socket, a trim removal tool, T25 Torx, a small flat screwdriver and a 90 degree pick. So first step to remove the door card, you need to remove this cover that's behind the handle, there's a bolt behind that. So you need a pick that's got a like a 90 degree hook on it and put it in and just get it around that gap at the back of this little panel there. Start from the back at the bottom and just pull it towards it and that cover will pop off. And then there's another one lower down here. This one's got two little notches on the bottom where you can get a tool in. Pull that towards you from the bottom and that's the other bolt. So now undo those two bolts, the T25 Torx ones. Now using a flat trim tool, start in one of the bottom corners of the door card and just put it in and turn it and pop the clips out. Once you get going you can get your fingers in and then pull and work your way around. Once they're all free, the door card will just lift up and pull towards you. So now we can see on the back of the door card, the first one is the cable that runs to the lock. So you need to undo, uh, put your screwdriver in, just pop that hook over and that will pull that out. And you can swing it round till it's level with the notch and pull that out. And then it's electrical plugs after that. So you can see on the blue one here, and on this one, that little tab at the end here needs to lift up so then you can pull the other side out so you're just pulling it up enough so you can get it over that little notch and further down here on the door module you've got another one of those plugs again exactly the same as the last one pop the little tab up at the end and pull that out and then the large plug here push that little tab in so that you can swing the pink arm over and as you swing the arm over the plug will release and pull that out and that's the door card removed. So once the door card's removed, next thing we need to do is remove the speaker. So the plug on the top, there's two little tabs, just push those in and pull the plug out. And then there's four 8mm bolts holding the speaker in, undo all of those. Once you've done all four bolts, the, spe the speaker is on little dowels and it'll pull straight out towards you. So now looking through the hole where the speaker is, you can see this plug there and that, um, that cable runs all the way up to the mirror, but the plug for some reason is, is down at the bottom. So this one's been zip tied in, so we'll just remove the zip tie and then the plug, and you can see, just get a flat screwdriver and insert it into that bit and just pop that up and the plug will separate. So where the wire runs up to the mirror, about halfway up, it's fixed to the door with a little cable guide. So if we pop this little cover out there by hand, if you go in there, you can sort of see there. You can just see at the bottom where it's 
where it's fixed into the door. So we're just gonna, that just pulls out. So we'll pull that out now. Now looking through the same hole, looking up at the back of the mirror, you can see there's a 13 mil bolt there. So loosen that off, that is the only bolt holding it in. So be aware as you're undoing it, the mirror is gonna, uh, is gonna start to loosen. So best thing to do is just using your other hand, hold the mirror around the other side. So I'm holding the mirror with my other hand. You pull that out. And the wire will come with it. And that's the mirror removed. So before we fit the door card back on, uh, we need to just look at these clips here that the door card's held in by. As you can see here, this is in the spread out position. What we need to do is reset these clips. Um, otherwise the door card just isn't gonna go on properly or you might break the clips. So if you pop that clip out, you can see here, these tabs are spread out. What we need to do is get this rod to click back in. This part here moves separately uh, to the rest of the body. And then that'll make the bits that are spread out there in line with the clip. So it allows it to go into the hole in the door card, uh, sorry, in the door. So we're using some snips there. Anything like that where you can just put equal pressure on either side and just pry it out. And there you see, just pop that clip out. So now when you're refitting that to the door card, you notice this white collar is pushed up against the clip. So you push the door card back on into the hole and as you bang on the door card, that will push that in and spread that out there. So make sure you go around um, each clip on the door card and reset all of those into that position and then refit them onto the door card. The door card here slides in, in between these two parts there. And the door card's ready to refit then.